AITA for refusing to take a photo of my sister to college with me? Before my parents had me, 18M, they had my sister, Emily. Emily was three years older than me, but she tragically passed away when I was just a few months old. My parents never fully recovered from her loss. Throughout my entire childhood, it felt like I was living in the shadow of the child they lost. I understand that grief can profoundly affect people, and losing a child is one of the most devastating experiences a parent can endure. However, it often felt like I didn't exist. My parents talked about Emily constantly. Sometimes they would acknowledge that she was gone, but more often, they spoke as if she were still with us. The most attention I ever received from them was when they made me say how much I loved and missed Emily. It never felt natural to say, I love Emily and I miss her so much, because I didn't know her, but I did feel haunted by her presence. There was a large photo of Emily on the wall opposite my bed growing up. My parents wanted me to fall asleep with my sister, watching over me. It always felt unsettling. They had photos of her in every room, even the bathroom. I remember once trying to take the photo in my room down, and my parents had an explosive reaction. They yelled so loudly that the neighbors came to check on us. Emily's room was never touched after she died, and sometimes my parents would sit in there for hours. Occasionally, they would make me sit with them, but I had to be very careful not to touch anything or disturb the room. Extended family members were often torn between being extra kind to me to make up for my parents' behavior or comforting my parents and putting the burden of their grief on my shoulders. They would tell me not to be too hard on my parents when they let me down. My parents could never celebrate any of my achievements. My extended family tried to fill that gap, but sometimes it felt like they came just to lecture me about compassion and understanding. Despite receiving no help or support from my parents, I did well in school and earned a full scholarship to college. Before I left, my extended family came over to say goodbye and to celebrate a little, as there could be no celebration of me at my parents' house. My parents gave me some photos of Emily to take with me to college, insisting that I'd need them for my dorm but I left them behind. I didn't want to take photos of Emily with me. I wanted to get away from that part of my life, which might seem unfair. The next day, my parents realized I hadn't taken the photos, and I received a text from my dad, calling me all sorts of names for leaving them behind. Then my extended family told me that I could have taken one and should have, because Emily is still my sister and I should try to remember her for my parents' sake, if not for my own. Ita, 